everyone this is alcabet analyst man and um today eagles officially know their opponent eagles chiefs let's get it man let's get it this is alcabet analyst let's get into it man eagles chiefs um it's kind of the matchup i wanted i think well we would have played honestly and i'm um, telling you i don't wish injury on no player but if it was the Eagles and the Bengals, I'm telling Joe Burrow would have got injured that game. Sorry to say, our defensive line is just too good. Um, hopefully within the two weeks, Patrick Mahomes can heal up a bit more. And be, because I want a fair game. I, I want to play Patrick Mahomes. I want to play him. I want that revenge against Andy Reid so bad. It will feel good to come in the Super Bowl because when he come to the link, he beat us. I mean, since Andy Reid been out of Philly, have we beaten him? I'm not even sure. But I want Andy Reid. I want Andy Reid. Yes, he's an Eagles legend. Yes, he did so much for the city. But I want Andy Reid, man. I want Patrick Mahomes. I want these dudes. Because when I look at the Bengals, maybe they would have been the best matchup. But I, I would defensive line against the offensive line. All backups. Man, Hargrave, Reddit, Sweat, they would have been there like every one second. No exaggeration, no over exaggeration. Now, the Chiefs defensive line looked good, but come on. They ain't doing that against our offensive line because what I think it's going to come down to this game, as much as a dynamic offense both of these teams are, Watch it go opposite. It's going to go just like how we played the Niners. Not far as the scoreboard, but which team made the mistakes? And one thing I could say, Patrick Mahomes might win the MVP. He's dynamic. He do this and all that. But one thing he will do, he will give you a pick. He, he will give you a turnover. And that's up to us how we execute. We got to execute those turnovers, turn them into points and not just three points. We need seven points or six points you want to say we need a touchdown when we get those turnovers because he's going to throw you one he's going to throw you one and um yeah man we, we just got to get after him get after him and i believe we're going to do that hurts this is a game we might not need him to do too much either don't do too much manage it a bit and um don't then just play mistake free football Give, feed your guys. Get them involved early. Get A.J. Brown rolling early. They don't have the secondary that the 49ers have. So don't be surprised if we get some long balls here and there. And we got two weeks to get Jalen Hurts and A.J. Brown on that back on that same level. Because Jalen Hurts been overthrowing A.J. Brown. Even though this last one, I re-looked at it. It seemed like, and it wasn't even A.J. Brown fault either. It's, it's the way the route was ran. He slowed down a bit. Now it's... And it seemed like the way Jalen Hurts threw it, he thought he was going to keep that stride, and that's why A.J. Brown missed it. But he slowed down, hit the guy with a nice move. Played, I believe that was Jimmy Ward. Hit him with a nice move, and um, Jalen Hurts just overthrew him. Just that little bit of slowing down. So, um, yeah, man, watch out for Smitty, of course. I think Goddard is going to... It's going to be a game, man. It's definitely going to be a game. And it feel good to have our guys back like Avante Maddox, man, his presence was felt. His presence was felt. Even though on the stat sheet, it really doesn't like show like that, but his presence was felt, and it just opened up the game plan for Jonathan Gannon. And when Jonathan Gannon got an open game plan, you see what we can do. Seen the Giants, seen the 49ers. Man, he's more aggressive. He played more up. So it, it, it felt good to have Avante Maddox back. Whereas though Jonathan Gannon don't play so passive. So, yeah, man, this is going to be a classic. This is going to be a good game. This is going to be a fun Super Bowl. Both teams worked hard. We're talking about two all-pro quarterbacks. We're talking about, I think, about, uh, we got about the same amount of, not really, not the same amount of pro bowlers, but I believe they second. I believe we had the first. We was tied with the Cowboys with the most pro bowlers. I think they were second, or it was like top first with them. So I'm just speaking of two dynamic teams. Both deserve to be in the Super Bowl. 
Um, yeah, man. Like I said, just just a very great game. Very great game coming up. Eagles, Chiefs, can't ask for a better one. And uh, let the best team win it all. I believe my squad is the best team. You no know, Chiefs fans believe they squad is the best team. And, man, it, it will feel good. It will feel good to get Andy Reid, Patrick Mahomes. And if Jalen Hurts win this, got to put him in that conversation. I know a lot of you guys see my reaction with Shannon Sharp. Can't disrespect this man nor. The best way to beat Jalen Hurts, the best way, the offense got to turn the ball over. Look at the games we lost. The offense got to turn the ball over. It's not necessarily his arm and keeping him in the pocket. None of that goofy stuff these analysts come up with. Is can the Eagles offense turn the ball over? That's a yes. You probably got a shot. You probably got a shot. But we play mistake free football, hold on to the ball, long possessions, and we turn you over. It's going to be a long day for your team. A long day because we can beat you with the run. Hell, you want to play up? Jalen Hurst is going to throw it over your head. It is what it is. It is what it is. And when I look at the statistics right now, the Chiefs will give you the ball. We just have to take advantage. Kelsey Bowles on the way. I can't wait to listen to the podcast. It's going to be a great listen. And I'm uh, going to finally get some sleep, man. I shot three videos. Tomorrow, a video will drop. Just giving my recap of the game against the 49ers and my thoughts of that game. And I just had to hurry up and shoot this one because the game is over. It was a very good game that Bengals and Chiefs, very good game. You know, like I said, Cincinnati, I, I really didn't want them, not because I fear them, because I, I, I think we're, I don't know. I don't know, man. I, our defensive line versus that old line, man. Let me just say that. Let me say that, man. But this is Al Kabir, the analyst. Ghost.